Hi guys, in this video, we're going to be talking about EasyBee's integration features. Before getting started, let me talk about what EasyBee is. EasyBee is a Chrome extension that works on WhatsApp web to provide features like CRM integration, team inbox, analytics, quick reply, scheduling messages, AI responses, as well as many more features. Now let me show you how to integrate Zoho CRM with WhatsApp using EasyBee. As you can see, I've already logged into my WhatsApp account and I have EasyBee installed. All I need to do to connect with Zoho CRM is click on the integrations icon here and click on connect. As you can see, I now have the authorization page to connect EasyB with Zoho. All I need to do here is click on accept, which will redirect me back to workspace and click on go back to WhatsApp. Now, as you can see, we have the Zoho icon here and I can close this integration window now and close this as well. Now I can open up a contact and click on the Zoho icon and all my data from the CRM will show up here on WhatsApp. I can manage all the data here. I can change the first name and I click on save. And if I see this change, I can be, I'll be able to see this change on the CRM as well. As you can see, the changes have synced with Soho. Apart from profiles, we also offer notes and we can manage our notes from WhatsApp itself. We also offer chat backup for leads on Zoho, which sync at an interval of 15 minutes. Apart from this leads module, we also offer contacts module, which works in conjunction to our leads module on Zoho. In contacts module, we offer notes, tasks, deals, as well as profile management sections. Here, I'm gonna be showing you a demo on how to create deals on EasyBee. I'll just click on new deal and enter an amount. Potential name, which is mandatory, closing date, stage, probability 10, and click on save deal. Now, once this deal is created successfully, I can I can click on view contact on Zoho and I'll be able to view this deal and manage it from the CRM as well as WhatsApp. We also offer chat backup on Zoho contacts module, which backs up at a similar time period of 15 minutes. Apart from all these features, we also offer users to customize their Zoho profile section with the help of the edit properties button here. And which is going to open up this suite of properties that I can add to my CRM on WhatsApp. Now I can click on full name and depart department and set it as mandatory and department as mandatory, mandatory as well and I'm going to, going to click on apply. Now if I click on Zoho contracts again, I'll be able to see that these two properties are now mandatory to be added. Now suppose a contact doesn't exist on Zoho, um, like this contact. Now suppose a contact doesn't exist on Zoho, like for example this contact, I'm going to just check if it exists on Zoho or not. And if it doesn't exist on Zoho, I can create this contact on WhatsApp itself. And this is going to be synced with the contact on Zoho. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.